Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about the Afghanistan box camera. The Afghanistan box camera is a camera come dark room or in one box. You can actually take a, a photo using photo paper as the negative and then process the photo paper inside the box itself. This is the second camera that I built, although this time I ordered a box from China and then add on the other parts myself, like the lens hole, the sleeve hole, the back door, and the internal focusing uh, uh, frame. Here you see I have a Fujinon uh, 210mm f5.6 lens. This is a 4x5 lens, but I can use it to shoot up to 5x7 negatives. On this side, we have the sleeve hole. Right, so we have a dark sleeve where one can insert uh, his hand into the box to take out the photo paper and also to process the photo paper in the developer and fixer. At the back, we have a door where we can open up and then uh, look in to see whether is the image uh, focused on the ground glass. Uh, on top is the focusing rod where we can uh, pull in and out so that we can uh, do the focusing. So let's take a look inside the box. There is a simple focusing mechanism inside the box. There's a ground glass uh, in there. And then by moving the focusing rod, you are actually changing the position of the ground glass. At the point, the uh, image will be uh, sharp on the ground glass. In the camera box, we also have a paper safe box where we store our photo paper. We can insert our hand through the dark sleeve into the camera box and take out a piece of paper and put it into the ground glass frame when we are ready to shoot. We also need the photo camera makers, the developer and the fixer. So we we'll have two tray inside the box. And then uh, now I will pour the chemicals into the tray. So with the chemicals in, the focusing done and the photo paper loaded, I am now ready to take my own portrait. Okay, uh, again we can go through the dark sleeve hole to take out the photo paper and then put it inside the developer and fixer. And then it should produce a, what we call a photo negative. Right. So I have taken the picture using a digital camera and then invert it into a positive using an editing software like Photoshop. Uh, the other way to turn it into a positive is to use the box camera to take a picture of the photo negative. Right, this is what I'm trying to do here. And here is the result. You'll notice that the orientation is fit because we are taking a picture of the negative. So now the positive is showing the right orientation where the sitter, me, is sitting. 
Uh, we can also do contact printing to get a positive picture. But today, just for fun, I'm going to use a method known as uh, lumens printing or solar printing. We are going to uh, use the sun to expose the photo paper for a long period of time. Uh, this process is not permanent because the photo paper is not going to be developed or fixed. So I went into the dark room to take out a piece of photo paper. Usually we do not bring an unexposed photo paper out into the light, but for this process you can do so. So what you need to do is to um, put the emulsion side of the blank photo paper uh, facing the photo negative image right? and then uh, secure it between two pieces of glass so that they will be uh, flattened and in uh, close contact. So this is why it's called contact printing. Okay, now we are almost ready to bring the whole thing out to daylight. Do take note that the photo paper should be on top and the new uh, or blank photo paper should be below for the contact printing to work. So after a few hours of sunning, let's take a look at what the effect will be like. So you will see a positive image being formed on the bottom piece of paper. Uh, as I mentioned, this is not going to be permanent as the photo paper is not fixed. You can either scan it or put the piece of uh, photo paper in a dark place so that it will not fade off too easily. Okay, thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoy it and uh, now you understand more about the functionality of this Afghanistan box camera. Hi guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification. Please also share and like this video. Take care and I see you at my next video.